Like, it's not the real, real reaction, but that Luca and the Mavericks, what they just did? I don't even know if I want to recap that. I might just want to jump into the Suns, like, for real, for real. Like, Dallas, Jalen Brunson, Spencer Dinwiddie. Finally, my nigga! I need this all series. I ain't gonna... I, I can say whatever I want about how I feel about Golden State. I don't give a fuck. Fuck the Warriors. <laughs> fans. The fans. Like, yeah, yeah, like, some of y'all come out of nowhere. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, bro. I'm sorry, bro. Yeah, y'all fans ought to be the worst fans ever, bro. I ain't never seen some people argue against it. And I'm more mad that y'all argue against John Morant injury so crazy. It, just, it was just crazy how much y'all trolling, like, trolling the fuck out of him. Like, yeah, I don't dick. I ain't gonna lie. But I, I let's talk about um the Suns. Bro, what the fuck? What the fuck? Y'all were up two zero. Chris Paul, this is starting to come too. Like, we gotta seriously discuss. I might say this for another video. I ain't gonna lie. I'm doing. I'm just gonna talk about Luka. We are gonna save Chris Paul for the next one, so he can have a solo video. But um. The the Mavericks they um they got a chance. That to me where they lack is the there's the rebounding aspect in the bigs because you just seen the Warriors go out there. Kevon Looney just came to start and got 22 rebounds. Like they found a way to be a big team and and rebounding somehow, and that's something you gotta realize. Yeah, I gotta make Curry and Clay struggle. Or even Jordan Poole. You got to make two out of three of them struggle. Which I don't think is a hard task because I... I look at it. It's not being a hater. I really watch these games, bro. They... they People... The way, the way the, everyone want to see the Warriors, they ain't that same Warriors. They just were fortunate to me to beat Memphis. I'm not trying to really discuss too much of the Warriors, but maybe down the line. But that's what the Mavs got to know. Mavs got to have big time score, um, scoring. And big time contribu 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 contributions from everybody outside of Luka. Luka's going to get 30 to 40. Nobody can guard Luka Doncic. Let's keep it a stizzy stack. He might be the best player in the league. You know, I don't think so. But Giannis is up there, right there. I think Luka is top five, arguably top three. I honestly have him over Kevin Durant. And I'm not doing legacy. People want to do legacy when they decide um, who better right now. I'm not doing legacy. I'm just going for my last three three years. I always go for like a distance of years. And I felt that Luca to me is much more much much better leader. And 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 like that leadership aspect, I know he hasn't won none yet. And people wanna wait. He won he won yet? I don't wait that long to say somebody's better. I'm not saying who could deliver me a championship like who's delivered me a championship already because let's be let's be honest, bro. Kevin Durant Hasn't done an outside of Golden State yet. And and much as y'all want to ignore that, is this a fact, bro? Until he does that? Because, look, it, you can say the same thing about LeBron when he was in Miami. Oh, he hasn't won outside of on Miami. He went and won in Cleveland. He went and won in L.A. So it's like he went and proved it. And the difference between that, Miami didn't win before. Like, they won with Shaq and them years or years before that. But, like... They were just like a like a seven seed before LeBron got there, so LeBron elevated them. Kevin Durant went to a 73-9 team, so if I say Luka's better than Kevin Durant, it's more of the years I've been seeing. I've been seeing Luka. He losing in the first rounds, but he it's not him. It's never been him. He go out there and give everything he got. He's, he didn't have the consistent of a 27-point scorer until now somewhat, and the defense is so much better without Chris Porzingis because Chris Porzingis was... Sometimes you would think this is the thing about Chris Pass, Chris Tess was saying is you either he was a freaking all a great defender or he was a liability. It seemed like it was never like, it was either or it was never in between. So in more in more case than not, he was the liability. Liability, yeah. So this team is a little different and the Suns is a little sad. Um because y'all up 2-0. But I'm a, I told you, I'm having a separate video for Chris Paul and Devin Booker. I got some words for them. I'm not going to lie, I got words for them, brother. What my man Stephen Nagel said, I got some words for them this morning. And like I said, 
I want y'all to be more engaged with me. Um, not sure how these videos gonna do. Um, I just want a different aspect of like which I know like I love to do. Like I try to tell people I'm just not a gamer. I like to do this all, bro. This is all. I love doing all this, bro. I love speaking, y'all. I love, I love talking more to anybody, bro. I love talking sports between football and basketball, purely. So, you know, I don't really, I don't, I'm gonna try to do what I could do, you know, for the sports thing, and I really in time make a podcast and shit with my mans and stuff. Already got this in line. I just want y'all to know. I want y'all. I want to get y'all. I want y'all to come and fuck with me. Come over here. Come over here. Come to the coach's side. We valid over here. Like we, this is what we do. Coach your job. Coach your period. You know, coach the brand. Know it. I ain't gonna lie. But like I said, congrats to the Luca. Um, to the um. Da- I'm about to say the Luca Mavericks. <laughs> I'm about to say the Luca Mavericks. To congratulations to the Dallas Mavericks. But the job ain't finished. You could be happy right now. The job ain't finished. Just stay composed. Y'all about to go play some few. Few. A tough team. I can't say the Warriors in a tough team. All right, so congratulations to y'all. It's more work to be done. I'll give my finals predictions before, of course, a game happens. So, um, is it a game today? It's Monday. I doubt it. Then the first game is tomorrow. But um, it's going to be a long day. All right? Like I said, go look at that Chris Paul joint. What I'm about to do to him. Yeah, we got words. Yeah, we got words. Chris Paul never. Yeah. Y'all stay culture and y'all comment what y'all, what y'all think about that um, series between Mavericks and the Suns. And then go check out the other videos I dropped today on Chris Ford and Devin Booker. The um, Bucks and Celtic series and the Tatum thing. Go look at those. Alright. Y'all stay culture.